can you tell um, the people watching what your thought process was and kind of the experience um, in deciding to come down in for our December camp? Yeah, sure. So I think that um, really, as far as coming down, it's just being, you know, following the rules, wear your mask, you know, do the right things that everybody knows about when you travel. You can distance in the airport. You know, there's a lot of things you can do to minimize your risk. And I mean, frankly, I didn't think it was any more risky than going to the grocery store or some other things that people are doing, dining, uh, those types of things. So really, you know, just doing the right thing made it a lot, I think, easier and safer. And my experience down there was, was really simple. And were you taking care, like what were you doing at home in San Diego, like in relation to how you were taking care? Yeah, I mean, I, I don't think I was, do anything dramatically different than I was at home. You know, same kind of thing, just keeping my mask in the areas that I should be um, and being practical and using common sense. And I don't think that the risk was any greater as far as getting here than, than just being at home. Yeah, so getting on the plane and the, the travel, getting from San Diego to Blue Zone didn't feel any different than, you know, going to the grocery store, going out to eat. Yeah, I mean, getting get into Blue Zone, Essentially, we've got the van, we wear our masks, the windows are open, um, and yeah, it's, you know, it's pretty straightforward. Didn't spend hardly any time at the airport, got out of there quickly, got through customs fast, and it was simple. And once you were down here at the camp house, how did you feel just during your time at the, the camp house? Yeah, I think being at the camp house, uh, it's really a good setup. The way that the rooms, you know, everybody's got their own rooms. All the meals are outdoors, so you're never really indoors with anybody, uh, with the exception of you know maybe on some of the film review sessions, but everybody's wearing masks and still kind of keeping their distance. So I think as long as everybody here is respectful and kind of wearing the mask when they should be, you feel very comfortable. It really, it was less stressful being here than being at home. <laughs> <laughs> and is there anything you would say to someone who is kind of on the fence, like they're they're taking care? Or, and, and they, they want to come, but maybe they're like, ah, I'm going to wait until the vaccine. Obviously, that's an individual choice, but maybe someone on the fence, um, like a friend, saying uh, that they're like, I, I really want to go on a surf trip and I don't want to wait a year. What would you tell them? Like, Yeah, I mean, I would just say that, sure, there's some risk, but if you do all the right things, that, I mean, by now everybody knows you need to wear a mask in certain uh, spots. Um, but the experience down here is so good it's totally worth it. I, I, I'm glad I didn't wait another year. Uh, you know, the camp is awesome. And uh, I would just say, you know, be careful. You know, you be as cautious as you, as you want on the way down. Don't feel bad if you're double masked and wearing gloves. Who cares? Get here and you're going to have a great time. And feel safe. Yeah. Yeah, yeah for sure. And catch, catch as high waves, waves <laughs> left, right. Yeah. Awesome. So, Thanks, Arnie. Yeah, sure.